Tantrum. He was a dude. That yeah, he's got problems. Sketchy. Yeah, so they can't get anybody yeah. out. So they're, they're, trying, they're, spit, they're starting to spit, starting to dig up the film. It's their tactic. Oh, uh, look at his legs. Leave it like that for a while. Gives it a wing. Keep going. Yeah. Just hold it a second. Yeah, start again. Sorry, Anfaz. The, the description of this portrait basically is uh, an oval with various fetishes, I would say erotic fetishes. You have a, you have a man here in for some strange trippy reason in a pond within the oval, who, in which I've created like a statue, all relatively all gay erotic symbols with a, with a a Gino chain on and his tongue sticking out. Here we have a, a standard labourer, working class, schlong victim with a Hardman hat on, flying in my in my world as a as a bird kite with a studded collar, with a bit of wind wishing him. Here's another chap here with a with a club or a baseball bat. Walking his sheep, as he does daily, also with a studded collar. About to bash this strange guy here in the pond. And then you have a stalker here who is, who is part of the Ku Klux Klan. And he has bifocals or binoculars. And he's watching the whole obscenity with, with a heart on, in, uh, hidden in his, in his pants. And this here is, of course, the, the 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 title of the of the oval and the whole setting. It's called Oval Times Oval. And what what inspired you to do this, Anthony? Hmm, that's a good question. <laughs> to tell you the truth, I still have to ask myself that question. How I come up with these ideas. So, quite frankly, I still don't know myself. May even be a hidden hidden fetish or dreams, erotic imagination. What's this got to do with kite surfing? What a great deal! Basically, the wind factor. And the uh, the bird, or the bird kite, as I like to call it, describes uh, the the kite kite side of the things. I'm not saying that it's a gay sport or anything. I believe it's actually quite a cool sport. I'm not having tried it myself yet.